What's up, everybody, and welcome to the channel. My name is Will, and I'm joined, as always, by the lovely, wonderful Miss Erica. Hey. And today we're playing Pumpkin Jack. Let's yeah. get into it. This is a uh, it's a Halloween themed game from last year, and it's very similar to like or very inspired by games like Spyro yes. and other old school games like this. So let's check it out. Halloween's year round. And as always, guys, we'll give you our first impressions as we go along. Looks like we got sort of a fairy tale story. Even the cute little bunny rabbits. Bunny It was an age of prosperity. Our cat is joining us for this as well. Sure is. I'm sure her purring is being caught on the microphone. Very boring. I was wondering where they were going with this. That even the devil himself was bored brainless. The devil dreamed of bloodshed, pestilence. Satan! On a scale. <laughs> so, he devised a plan to make things in Arkansas a little more entertaining. Mm. Okie dokie. The devil unleashed the curse of the eternal night. Ooh. Just seems like an overreaction, if you ask me. So he was just bored, so he put the entire world into darkness? The monsters laid waste to them. every city, every home. Every leaky outhouse and backwater town in the kingdom. <laughs> it was beautiful. Yikes! Beautiful. But no, not beautiful. Reason, the humans quite enjoyed their safe, boring little lives. They couldn't handle a few pesky monsters coming in and tearing them all. <laughs> the how? Wow! How could they not uh, deal with that? Come on now. I don't know. Mighty wizard. A sorcerer with the skill and intellect to break the curse and usurp the devil's power. The wizard departed his luxurious tower in his studies to find the power he needed to break You're the wizard. curse. <laughs> You're a wizard, Harry! Very well, the devil said. Two can play that game. And who knows? There's a lot of exposition going on here. This story is much more in-depth than I thought it would be. Yeah, I just thought we were going to be a pumpkin. <laughs> That you really thought that was the whole game, just a pumpkin? Jack, history's greatest trickster and con. I was here for it. Banished to wander the world as a wayward spirit. The devil crammed Jack's soul into the skin of a pumpkin and made him a deal. The devil would forgive Jack's past misdeeds and grant him passage to the afterlife. Okay, mm. what's the catch? In return. He gave Jack one simple mission. Mm -hmm. Find the wizard. Destroy him. Hmm. Okay. So we're the bad guy. I just thought of Billie Eilish. <laughs> I don't think that's how that song goes. But Isn't it? Go with it. Um, ba, 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 da, something, da, something da, bad da, guy. Da, 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 sad guy. I don't know if it's sad yeah. guy. That was the first word I could think of. Okay. All right. Anyway, let's go. We'll listen to that later. This world is a mess. The devil meant what he said about total death and destruction. Okay. Cat loves it. Well, the camera's like weirdly sensitive. Like. Oh yeah, it's like. It's kind of like swinging around like way too much. All right, A to jump, easy. You could probably change that in the settings. Active uh, to passive. Probably, I would imagine you can change sensitivity. Yeah. But we'll we'll just Ooh, roll with boy, it. Oh boy, an owl. Hoot hoot, hoo hoo hoo! Look who bothered to show up. Trust you haven't already lost your brain in that gourd. Grown men have died for less than that, bird. Tardy and insubordinate. Not an amazing first impression, Jack. Who are you? How do you know my name? I am a servant of the devil, and I'm here to monitor your work. As owls are. Are owls considered evil? Mm, in some cultures, yeah. Hmm. The devil hasn't forgotten your penchant for trickery, Jack. He doesn't trust you. Just don't slow me down. I haven't forgotten how to roast a chicken. Who, who, who? Just remember who gave you that fancy new body. Speaking of which, let's begin your orientation. Okay, training time. What kind of fool do you take me for? The kind who spent centuries incorp incorporalis? I can't read. Now stop it like It's time you get acquainted with your new form. We're not here to read. Uh, so far, interesting. Graphically, as well, I, I would say. I love it. Story is interesting. Writing is sort of amusing. I think the environment is cool. You'd be wise to drink from these cauldrons. The primordial stew holds your new body together. Ew. 
Oh, uh, save points. What's this gonna be like Dark Souls where you have like the campfires? Oh, maybe. Double jump. Easy. Can I jump that far? Okay. Uh huh. The cat is also watching the game here and there. Yeah, she likes to watch TV and video games. She She's does. a little weird. What's that thingy, Majigger? Donut County was her favorite, though. That's true. Go check out our Donut County video sometime. You'll see why. Actually, I don't even know why, now that I think about it. Why did Baby Cat like that game so much? She loved it, though. Alright. Simple so far. So the crow skulls. Oh, jump! Uh -huh. Get a running start, double jump across the river. Okay, easy. Not so bad, you shake out these cobwebs well. Does feel good, I have my own body again. Arms, legs, everything. You'll really put them to the test room here. They'll be monsters ahead. Okay, enemy time. Should have any trouble fighting them off. Well, I've never been to one turn down chance to bash some heads in. What's wrong? Wouldn't the monsters be your friend? Yeah, I guess that's true, right? We are like the, the, the devil's like servant. Yeah. Maybe the monsters don't really care. Ah, okay. Oh. Ah. It was literally telling us as we were just uh, deciding. Very well. What was going on there? Okay. They can't be told anything, Jack. Monsters are mostly mindless miscreants. They can barely tell each other apart, let alone something like you. Pumpkin or not, you're still human. That alone makes you their target. Oh. Wait, we're human? So that's why the devil needs me. He needs someone who can think like a man. The new enemy is clever, Jack. He needs someone just as clever. Yeah, we were a trickster. Doesn't mind that I'm cutting down his monsters. They're practically worthless. Do what you must. Just get the job, the job, the job done. The job done. I can't barely read. Did your head turn the into gerb? a pumpkin? <laughs> Maybe it did. Um, story's sort of nonsensical, but maybe it's not meant to be that deep. I mean, no. it is a game called Pumpkin Jack, after yeah, all. I don't think it's supposed to be. All right, B to like do a little dodge move. Ow! <laughs> well, that didn't work so well. Yeah, I don't think it's supposed to be, like, a insightful, philosophical game. No. You're talking to a crow. <laughs> it's true. It's back, it's back. Flap away, everyone. Flap for your lives. More birds. Let me let me through before I pluck you all raw. He really hates birds. Stay away from my scarecrow. I've got claws and I can use them. Need a common scarecrow? I am Jack, the greatest rogue to ever live. Wait, he's got legs. The scarecrow doesn't have legs. And his head is stuffed with straw. See, I'm no scarecrow. Now let me through, you corvid creeps. Caw, not so fast. Caw! It seems the birds have the upper hand for once. We'll let you through, Mr. Jack, and help us in return. At the mercy of a crow, what do you want? The scarecrow often appears at that barn just ahead. He's been terrorizing us for weeks. He's a menace to crow kind. And I suppose you want me to get rid of him, then. Yes, yes, and I'll help you. To boot, my wings are swift, my beak is sharp. Some air spore could be useful. Very well, bird. Caw, huzzah! Death to the straw-faced menace. Crows might actually say this. They'll gang up on you if you make them um, upset. That is true. Crows are vindictive little bastards. All right, oh. so the crow helps us do stuff. Oh, oh god, oh god, get back, get back. You're gonna drown. Okay. Aha, okay, so we can use him to get things afar as well. Cool. All right, let's drink. Got your health back. Yep, yep, yep. I thought we were gonna be attacking enemies, though. Whoa, ow, okay. Um. Uh. Okay, so you kind of shoot the crow at them. Ah, okay. There's no, like, Ooh, weapon or anything yet. Mm -mm. Maybe there will be at some point. Probably. Ooh, a shovel. Ah! Ooh. It's mostly rust, but I suppose any weapon is better than none. That's valid. Attack. Okay. Smash! Jack, smash! A new checkpoint. I'm enjoying the music. Uh, it's very, like, Halloween-y. Yeah. Reminds me of the season. I Watching, like, Halloween. bad Halloween movies. My favorite. All right. Okay, how do we get up here? Double jump, double jump. I did that, but now I can't get to the other level. See? Why aren't I grabbing that? Hmm. Must be something I gotta do differently. Perhaps. Can the crow assist? Uh. 
Doesn't look like it. I don't Maybe see a way. Need to back up a little. We gotta like run first. There we go. There. Get a running start. Always helps. What do these things do? What did they explain what those were for? You're supposed to just collect them. It's like a little achievement kind of thing. Yeah. Wow. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Nice. Spin move. This is like Spyro Souls. <laughs> you gotta dodge and stuff. All right. Yeah, the music's fun. The environment's fun. Like what does breaking into stuff do? Monster essence? What? Oh. Ah, heals you. So if you break stuff, you can find ways to heal yourself. Okay. So I guess it's worth breaking things as you go along. Yeah. All right, getting the hang of it. Yeah, combat seems fun. Yeah, it's it's fine. It's very basic. I mean, once again, it's a game called Pumpkin Jack. I don't think we're looking for a cinematic style masterpiece. True, this isn't like Demon Souls, but yeah, maybe I don't know. Maybe has my uh, has my taste grown to a point where like. Childlike games no longer do the trick like they used to? I don't know. Maybe you're just a snob. Am I just an old snob? Could be. Could be. All right, how do we do this? I love a cutesy, fun little game. Because you didn't enjoy Donut County as much as I did either. Which no, I really didn't. And I, but the problem with Donut County was less uh, like the, the sort of theme of it, I guess. And just the fact that there wasn't really gameplay. Um... I thought it was like a fun game with fun writing, but like, I don't know, just the fact that it had such a simple mechanic that didn't really ever get more difficult, I think, sort of changed it for me. I loved it, and I enjoy this too. I mean, this is good so far. I'm not like complaining. I'm just saying like, I'm wondering if I've become too serious, too jaded of a gamer. Could be. Need to lighten up and play a silly game here and there. What's yeah, I guess that? so. I don't know. A present. A present. One out of five. So there seems to be a fair amount of collectibles. That does make uh, replayability a bit better, I would say. Yeah. So you can kind of take your time through these levels and explore more and stuff. Yeah, I can't imagine this is a super long game, though, either. No, I think in the Steam kind of, like, reviews I was seeing, they were saying around three to four hours, which yeah. feels fairly standard for indie games nowadays. Yeah. Kind of just, like, shorter runtime. And I don't know if that's an issue of development or just, like, maybe people have decided that their attention spans aren't long enough for these, like, 40 to 60 hour games. Yeah, there's really no in between anymore. It's either three hours or three hundred. Yeah, for real though. And I, I don't mind shorter games at all. I know some people they feel as though like you're not getting as much for your money. Eh. Um, but I don't really agree necessarily. I think as long as the, those three to four hours are really good, yeah, then I don't care. Are they fun or is the story strong or? Yeah, like I don't need you know a hundred hours of Assassin's Creed doing the same like three types of missions over and over again. Right. Now, will I play 900 hours of Animal Crossing? Yes. <laughs> That's different, though. Okay, perhaps your new body isn't needed here. Hop out for a minute and look inside. Wait, what? What? Hop out of my body. Of course, your new body's just a shell. You can always use your head. Hoo-hoo. What? You can get out of it? Oh, that's disgusting. Cram it, bird. Hop to a jack, drop your body, and head inside. Ha-ha. <laughs> or hoo-hoo-hoo. All right. What do we do here? Whoa! What the fuck? I'm a, I'm a pumpkin spider. Yeah. Kind of look like a squid billy on the bottom. You remember that It show? does look like a squid billy. You're absolutely right. <laughs> oh my god, that is that weird. That show was something else. That was a weird show. Yeah. Uh, that's a that 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 is classic Adult Swim right there. Wait, how do I? Can I not use the lever as the? Oh yes, I can. There you go. Guess I need to push. That movement is uncomfortable looking. <laughs> Makes it's me little, uncomfortable. It's a little odd. 
Wait, how do I... Hmm. Do I need... Can you stack them? Yeah, I was gonna say, do I need to stack these things? But how do I do that? Whoa. That was weird. Ah! I don't see any way to, like, push it up. But that's obviously what we have to do. Yeah, yeah. Um, okay. Let's see, let's see, let's see. Is that... Can you get down below? No, this is like an elevator, I think. Wait, hold on. I have an have idea. Have lined up right? I have an idea. Okay. If I can get this on here. Just a light. Can I just get like a light push? There we go. Okay. Ah! And then. Ah, yep, yep, yep. Like move stairs. us over here. Yep. Okay, okay, okay. <laughs> the, the 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 pumpkin squid is is freaking me out. Yeah. The squid belly pumpkin. That's fair. <laughs> Open sesame. The cat did not find this game as interesting. No, she's fallen asleep. She is passed out. Okay. Ooh. Checkpoint. The levels are fun. Well, I guess level, we've only experienced one level. Yeah, I wonder how long these levels are generally, or if it's like one continuous level. Yeah, but there's been a couple of Whoa, 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 whoa. Little, Holy crap, ah! Are those rats? A couple little, like, different rooms and... Yeah, a little bit of enemy variety here, yeah. which is nice. Oh, we gotta kill, um, the rat hole, I guess? Yeah. Or they just keep spawning? Yeah. Ow, I am hurting all Get of a sudden. Pro. Oh, wait, how do I get over there? Uh -huh. Around. I wonder what happens if we get them all. Mm. It might have said, and we just weren't reading. We do that sometimes, I've seen us. Forget to read things that are yeah. probably important. It looked like there was something underneath this little hayloft. Where? I thought there was a glowy happening back there. No, you fool. Okay. It's just spooky ambience. Oh, there's glow over there, though. Oh, mm. yeah. Fair mm. enough. Fair enough. Ah. The camera is like kind of moving so fast that it makes me a little sick. I'm not gonna lie. Yeah. Once again though, you could probably change that in the settings. Most of these little. Yeah, I would assume so. Ah, gotta kill that. Wonder if the shovel breaks. I hope not. That's all I have! True. Except for our little crow friend. Oh yeah, true. But he only shows up every once in a little while. That was dicey. What's over here? Wow. Present? Something over there, yeah. Present! Why are there snowmen? Uh, I don't know. That's a good question. Hmm. They were like... Creepy snowman. Yeah, is there gonna be like a Christmas area, maybe? Very nightmare before Christmas. Yeah, I was gonna say, there's gotta be some influence there, right? Oh yeah, 110%. There's a little crow skull. We almost have half of them already. We do, we do. All right, um, I don't know what to do now here though. Uh, oh, we can climb up here. Go up. Right, right. Ow, I keep knocking my elbow off the desk. <laughs> you might want to not do that. I'm gonna try. Okay. Uh... Oof. Oof. Hard to see, hard to see there. Uh... Down, there's a cauldron. Oh, I thought maybe I had to go up there for some reason. Mm. Checkpoint! I like the little checkpoint sound effect. <laughs> yeah, it's this game is very like I don't know. It makes me think of like what's that movie you like so much? The Halloween movie. Oh, that's on fire. Hocus Everything's pocus. blowing up. Oh my god! Oh my god! Everything's on fire. Oh no! 
That was definitely getting a Hocus Pocus sort of vibe, just like sort of kids Halloween movie. I love Hocus Pocus. Why is everything on fire? I don't know, but you should probably figure it out. Oh, uh, did you die? Oh, no. Oh. Could this be a boss? Or some kind of speed run area? Mm. We gotta get the flap out of here. Run! Uh, speed run! I don't think there's a way to run faster. Go ahead! Uh, this is intense. They keep holy guacamole! Bro, go! Crow, uh, go! Oh boy. Oh. This game got way more stressful. <laughs> yeah! I was kind of waiting for something like this. I feel like all those kind of older PlayStation games, like Spyro and stuff, will have stuff like this. Yeah, they love to make you run and like scream continuously while you were running. <laughs> Just woo! Yeah, when I was a kid, it definitely stressed me out. In fact, going back to some of those games, I wonder how kids completed them. Because they're often yeah. a lot harder than I remember. Like our uh, our revisiting of Crash. Oh, I will um, never play Crash Bandicoot again. I was so angry. It is truly the most maddening game I've ever played in my life. Hmm. Hey, we did it. Yay. Yeah. Look at us go. Yeah. Wow, you read the place, Jack. I didn't see that. All the scare Scarecrow must be back in the fields. So that Scarecrow must be the boss. Must be. Well, uh, any kind of final thoughts as we're sort of wrapping up here for this video? I mean, I love Halloween. So is my opinion of this game 110% biased? Probably. <laughs> oh, wait. You know what? Let's show this boss fight. Let's show the boss Why fight. Why not? Normally try to keep these videos in around 20-ish minutes, but uh, that seems like a good place to go. Yeah, I thought with. we had a little further to go before the boss, but since he's here. Time you hopped away. Heard you were skulking around here, Jack. We did with a monsters out of cutting it for the old man. Hmm. I have my own business, Scarecrow. If you don't get out of my way, I won't mind turning you into kindling. He's a pretty scary scarecrow. <laughs> I guess that's the idea, right? I guess. The devil has the gall to send some wayward soul to do our jobs for us. We'll show him all the humans are good for, living or dead. I'll bury you again, you wretch. Ah. Whoa. Whoa. Whoa, whoa. Crow, crow, crow. Pew. Didn't work. Didn't do it fast enough. Aha. Now hit him. Yeah, 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 yeah. Whoa. Well, if you just stay far enough, it doesn't hit you. I'm sure that'll change. Oh, man. Woo! Oh, yeah. I am pro at this game now. Seems like a quintessential boss battle. Yep. All about timing and learning your patterns. Yep. Classic. Classic. Oh. It seems like it expanded just a little bit. Uh, not really. Looks like it's just gonna be kind of a repetitive situation here. Standard. Standard procedure. Yeah, you can't hit me. Was that it? Yay! Easy clap. Oh, and we got a cool spear. Sick. Nice.